Hey friends, Gator Mom here. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you've had a great week and are ready for the weekend. Today I'm talking all about a brand that I have never featured here on my channel, and that's Rothy's. <music> All right, I'm excited to jump right in and start talking about the couple of items that I got from Rothy's. I've been excited to share this particular video with you because like I said before, it's a brand that I've never personally tried, one that I've never featured on this channel, and one that everybody raves about. Like when you hear of Rothy's, I know me personally, I automatically think of their shoes and I think of the comfort everybody talks about and the materials and all of the things, but I've never actually tried anything from the brand. So when I was looking around on the website, their bags immediately caught my eye, naturally, since that's kind of what I gravitate towards. Um, and I really liked their style of the bag that I'm showing you today. So before I get in and kind of give you a first impressions and let you see everything, I wanna let you know that I am planning on doing my traditional review and packing video with everything that you're gonna see here today. But I thought a first impressions video would be good kind of upfront to talk about a couple of the reasons why I purchased this bag, what drew me to the company, and things like that. So right off of the bat, um, I want to talk about the care for this particular bag. This is not a cheap bag, it's a luxury purchase. It's one that I really thought out and kind of researched before I bought it, and one that I'm really impressed about. So all of their bags, to my knowledge, of course, this is the first one I've bought, but they come with a garment bag that you can actually wash in your washing machine. So those of you that aren't new to my channel know that I tend to gravitate towards bags that are easy to take care of. One that is comfortable out in all types of weather being in Florida, one that I can put in the washing machine because hello, I have three kids and I'm not gentle on my bags. So if I'm gonna make a big purchase, I think it's awesome that I can take care of it really easily. So like I said, it comes with this big bag that you can throw it inside and put it in your washing machine and then it does recommend to air dry it, which I typically would anyways with any bags or um, item like this that I would wash. So that was one of the number one things that drew me to the bag. Another thing that drew me to the bag was the type of material and what these items are made out of. So I don't want to butcher it. <laughs> so I'm going to read right from their website. But the material of this particular bag and the items that I'm sharing with you are knit with 100% recycled materials, which is so cool. Um, it's crafted with a blend of ocean bound marine plastic and Rothy's signature thread. That to me was super cool, really, really different, something I've never tried before, I've never seen before. And let me tell you, the material of these bags is 100% different than anything I've ever seen before. <laughs> like, it is durable, it's really, really high quality in my opinion, and I'm impressed with all of the ins and outs of it. So let's jump right in and start off with the tote. All right, so like I said, the bag comes with your um, garment bag to actually wash it in the washing machine. It also comes with a really soft, nice dust bag, and it has the little Rothy's logo kind of here in the middle. It's drawstring at the top, so you have that to protect your bag. And then I wanna show you the box that it came in really quickly because I think it's different um, and unique. It comes in a flat box like this. When you open it up, you have this signature blue Rothy's line that you'll see on all of their items. It's right here kind of on the box. And then on the inside, written right here oop, in the middle of the box there, it says sustainable since day one. We proudly crafted this bag partially from ocean bound plastics collected within 30 miles of coastlines and marine environments. This bag was knit with 100% recycled material. I think that's super cool. So this is what the box looks like and you open it up and there you have it. So you can store it in the um, bag that it comes with, of course, or you can keep the box and store it in that. The color I chose in the Essential Tote was this desert sand color. And let me tell you, I had a really hard time picking out what color I wanted to get in this particular tote because they have so many fun ones. I originally thought for sure I was gonna get one of the camo ones. They have a green camo and a gray camo, and I still really like those. But I saw this one and I thought I would go with a more like neutral option because I can use it a little bit more freely like all year round. This one's cool because it has like a darker kind of brownish taupe color here at the bottom with like a cream stripe and then you have this pop of I guess it's almost like a poppy or like a red color 
um, but it's really fun. It's not like a deep red or anything like that. It's it's a really pretty shade um, right here at the top. And then the handles are that same like poppy type color. And the um, like trim here on the handles are a little bit darker than the muted color here on the inside. So I just thought it was really different looking. I loved this color and I loved the accessories I picked out to kind of go with it. I think that it makes it even more fun. The signature Rothy's um, blue stripe is right here at the top of the bag. At the very end, I think I will go through and give you a little bit of up close video of this bag. So I know sometimes it's hard to see details of the bags when somebody's like holding it and showing it to you. And then also be reminded, I'm gonna do a full detailed review of this unpacking video in a later video probably coming to you next week. So if you have any details or any details, if you have any questions about how it packs up or anything like that, let me know in the comments um, so that I can address those in this video. So on the inside of this bag, this is what it looks like. It's a big open tote. It does zipper here at the top. So those of you that like your bags to zipper and close up, you have that option. But if you are kind of like me and don't really care too much about zippers, um, you can go ahead and fold the flap down and it doesn't pop up or anything like that. It just lays completely flat inside your bag. So inside here, you do have a zipper pocket that is sewn into the bag. These zippers are really, really smooth. They don't stick or anything like that. They're nice and smooth zippers. Um, so you have this pocket that is inside of the bag here. Then on the other side of the bag, you have these two magnetic um, like they're not really clips they're they're flat against the bag but they're two magnetic circles and you can attach the essential pouch which I'm about to show you next inside the bag and it's really cool how it attaches in there and kind of keeps it uh, separated from everything else on your bag so I will show you that in a second the bottom base of this bag is removable so whenever you're carrying for the bag if you're washing it or anything like that you can go ahead and take out this insert this gives it a little bit more structure at the bottom of the bag you don't have to use it if you don't want to the bag is a really durable soft material yet it kind of holds its own but it's not super structured if that makes sense so it's soft against your body you can really stuff it if you wanted to or you wouldn't have to you can pack it so many different ways i don't think you would have any trouble packing a laptop in here no matter what the size is um, of your laptop because this is a nice big roomy bag um, you could definitely put it in a case and have no issues um, on this particular bag so again this is the essential tote and i'll let you see kind of a side view of it here you have like a little v that kind of comes down over there the back is exactly the same as the front there's no exterior pockets or anything like that so let's move on to the essential pouch now. all right so just like the tote the essential pouch comes in a very similar box only smaller it has a dust bag with it to protect it when you're not using it but this here is what it looks like i cannot remember the name of this particular color or pattern um it is i believe like a summer color for them um it's one of their newer ones but it's one of the few that's actually has these like square patterns i love the way that it matches with this desert sand i wanted a very like neutral palette for my bag but i was excited to kind of get this pop of color in the pouch and this other accessory that i have i likely wouldn't have ordered the pouch by itself if i wasn't getting this tote just because i wouldn't have necessarily had a need for it but i'm so glad that i did and now seeing this pouch i would definitely recommend ordering it by itself too it's just a really strong like durable material it has again a really smooth zipper and this wristlet is attached to the zipper now on the back of it here it does have the circles like the magnetics that go inside that essential tote so i want to show you what that looks like attached on the inside of the bag it actually attaches kind of towards the bottom half of the bag if you will which is really cool again you'll be able to see this better in a later video but this is how it attaches inside the bag it's completely secure by these magnets which is cool because it won't fall around inside your bag or anything like that that is what it looks like. You have a little bit of a gap here at the top. Like I said, it kind of attaches near the bottom half there of the bag. So that is the essential tote. I'm excited to kind of pack this and show you everything that will fit inside. The lining on this one is like a bright pop of pink, which is really fun. And then you have the Rothy's logo 
right there on the inside too. So that there is the essential pouch. All right, second to last thing that I have to show you, I actually just remembered that I got something else in my order that I totally forgot about because it doesn't really go with the bags or anything like that. But they have a collection, if you will, or a group of catch-alls. And there are these little square um, organizers for your bags or luggage. They have three different sizes. They have a small one, a medium, and then a large one. I went ahead and opted for the medium size because I was really curious as to what I could pack in it, if I would enjoy this type of organization in my bags, and then I would order the large and the small maybe at a later date to compare for you guys. So this is what it looks like. I got it in the same color that I got the essential pouch in because I wanted them to kind of match together. I love it. <laughs> it is so different than anything that I have. I cannot say enough about how smooth these zippers are on all of the items. Like they're just really good quality. The zipper pull is doubled in color. Like it has that peachy color and like a bright pink color. When you open it up here, it has that same color that was in the inside of that essential pouch. And then you have the little Rothy's logo right here. So this is what it looks like. There's no really interior pockets or anything to it. It is simply like made to organize the inside of your bags. So I'm excited to see what will fit inside here and then pack it all up for you guys really soon. All right, the very last item that I grabbed from them that I totally forgot about are these face masks. Now I have read mixed reviews about them. Some people have like modeled them on Facebook and places like that and they look really big. And I thought that I would go ahead and try it on for you guys, show you what it looks like and talk about them. I have tried many face masks over the past couple of weeks and I love the material of this one. Now I have not worn it out yet, have not been outside or anything like that, but it seems to be like a really cool material. Um, it doesn't seem to be hot. It's very soft to the touch. It's a different type of material. So I think it will absorb sweat really well. Um, again, this is just a like complete first impressions of these particular masks. I did put this one on my oldest last night and he loved it. We were out all day with our masks on and he had a cheap kind of mask because he didn't like the other one that I had purchased for him. And um, he was wearing this like kind of cheap one all day and he didn't like it. And he put this on and he's like, oh my gosh, I wish I had this all day. <laughs> So I think this one will probably become his mask. These were two for, I want to say maybe 30 or 25, $30. I'm not exactly sure, but I thought they were pretty reasonable for the quality of the mask. Um, it does have these little, um, I get, they're not metal, but they do kind of form here at the top as far as like next to your nose and at the very top. So they're like form fitting to your face and you still do have the cute like signature Rothy's blue stripe, which I thought was really fun. So this is what it looks like on. I really like it. I think that it fits well to my face. Um, I think that it's cute looking. I don't think that it's like obnoxious. <laughs> like some of the face masks I've tried have been really, really bad ones. Um, and I really like it. I think that I have pretty a pretty average face. If not, I think it's a little bit smaller than average. I'm like kind of petite <laughs> as far as my face and my height and all of that goes. So I think it fits great. Um, it has good kind of coverage down here and then it fits really nice here at the top of my nose. So I really like it. I think that it feels great. Um, so yeah, I thought I would share those with you guys as well. <laughs> so that's everything that I have um, to share with you today. I hope that you guys are excited about this brand like I am. If you have any questions about any of the things I've shared that I can address in the next video where I do a detailed review and packing video, please let me know. And I do have a referral link below. Um, I believe it's $20 off your first purchase or something like that. So I'll have links to everything below like always um, and I'll have that referral link. So I will talk to you guys on my next video. Have a great weekend. Bye.